bride. What you are going to do is put your eyebrow back on. After you've kind of made it go away, you're gonna bring it back. All right, and you can just follow your natural eyebrow shape. This doesn't have to be a specific eyebrow. I'm just trying to put something on. Okay, so there's an eyebrow. Does it match my other one? No, that's okay. All right, so for the bride, your detail is going to be tears. Like you had on mascara and you cried too early. So your mascara is running down your face. All right. It's gonna look something like this. All right, and I'm not particular about you know, having the exact same lines as me. It just kind of has to be roughly the same look. As long as we can tell what is happening here, you're good. I'm just gonna try to So, once again, it is super awkward to do this into a phone. I can hardly see. So I'm gonna pat that out so I've smeared a little bit more. We wanna be able to tell that you've got rivulets running down your face. So, yeah, something like that. You can take it a little further down. I think I like the idea of it coming down past the cheekbone. But in this general direction, don't go straight down. You're probably like holding your head back and crying because you're so upset. <laughs> and it just started running this way. So you want it kind of at an angle. Not like this, just a little bit at an angle. All right, and because you probably had more makeup on when you were getting married, bride, let's make your lips a little bit more purple than gray or black. Okay. All right, so a little bit more purple and, pardon me, tears, purple and tears.